Hey guys, welcome to the channel. Today's August 11th. Today's video is going to be a four month update on the hypercharge. Been on here about four months. Um, I think a little less, but about four months. So we applied this on here one coat of hypercharge. Come on, guys. We're going to wash the Jeep with Suds Clarity soap. There's no wax in it, it's just a soap. So we're going to wash it up and see what it looks like. I'm going to dry it, no drying aid. And that kills me to do because I always like using a drying aid. Um, but we want to see with the results and see how well the Harbor Charge is holding up. You can see how dirty it's got. Man, I haven't, I tell you what, I haven't washed this Jeep and it's, it's got to be three weeks to a month. Beginning of July. Just I haven't had time to mess with it. I'm trying to make videos work in and it rains every weekend when I try to, try to do stuff. Because um, about the uh, weekend's the only time really I get a chance to wash the Jeep. When the wife's at work, sometimes she gets off work late. But let's look how dirty it is. You check out the wheels right here. Yeah. I'm giving a wash in. I'm going to do the inside. I need to test out some other product, products on the wheels, but we're not going to do that today. All right, we'll get washed in a minute, but first, gotta finish barbecuing. We're gonna wash her up. Hopefully, I don't lose my light, which pretty much always do. All right, let's let's uh get some water on it. Rinse it down. We'll see what it looks like. It's beating, not beating. You tell me. Four months. Look at that. I swear I haven't washed this in. It's gotta be a month. Look at that. You guys seen the beginning? Hopefully, in the beginning of the video, you've seen the water spot. And how dirty the vehicle is. We have not washed that, washed the roof, that's it. I don't know, I'll wash it, but from that right now, to me, without even washing it, it's working still. <laughs> It's working, guys. Hmm. It's weird, ain't it? Let's do different nozzles. Everyone likes the water test. I like doing it. Let's do the mask on it. Before we wash it. Let's do the plastic. If I didn't do the plastic, it would be dead. Let's do here. Let's do it. It's really squared in for that. It's beating like crazy. One coat. Alright, let's see what it looks like. It's beating. Look at that. Wow. Yeah, guys, that is working still. For one month. Four months. And one month not washing it. All that rain. Last few weeks, we've been in the 90s, 80s, 90s. We've been going up and down. Yeah, check that out. All right, let's hit, let's wash it up, and then we'll do this again before I dry it. Yeah, just by not even doing a water test at the end after drying it. I mean, it's working. I still got to wash this back. You can see how big the wheels are. Look at that. Kidding me? Four months on the windows. It's still beating. It's still heating on the back too. On the flat panels, watch. And it's dirty, I still gotta wash it. I hope you guys can see that.
four months it's working i know i keep bringing it up i just watch other videos and uh you know claiming it that this only lasts a month and nope it's lasting check this out real quick that suds box soap this soap is awesome i'll have the their website link below if you want to check them out it's a small company also that's uh making this detailing products another small detailing company to try to support soap soap's really good it's really good soap too for the winter okay we're all done washing it up let's look at it before we lose my son we'll do a water test real quick check it out still shining pretty good well, I like to even how dirty it was. Hopefully, it showed up. It washed really nice with that soap. Came right off, no scrubbing. Just gave it a quick wash too. Um, it was so dirty. I wasn't really not worried about it being like 100% perfect. It would just get it cleaned up. Cause I haven't washed it in a while. It had to be a month. wanted to get the interior clean but uh, i'll have to do that tomorrow we'll check it out oh, nothing's been sticking to it we'll do a water test a couple uh and we'll check it out yeah it's coming it came out nice stuff to me it's working pretty good i believe all right let me grab the holes and we'll uh, get this test going before i lose my light i've been trying all right we're gonna go mist let's check it out guys We'll do a little bit. There we go. Check that out. Sheathing when it needs to be. Just look at that speeding like crazy. I granted, I know everybody we want mainly want to sheet. But the beating kind of gives us an idea, I guess, if that the product is still working. I mean, that's what everybody goes by in those panel tests and stuff like that. So check that out. All right. Yeah, that looks good. All right, let's go. Uh, let's go center. Put some water on it. See how it's sheeting. See how it does. That's moving pretty decent right there. Same thing there. That's sheeting pretty good. For light change anyway. Look at that guys. There it goes. Gonna sheet faster there, it's rounded right there. This hood kind of flat, except for the ends, it's rounded off. Got a little angle on the front. Put a little something in the middle, see how it sheets. Yeah, it comes right off. Look at that. It's pretty good. Alright, let's test it out on these windows. If I can find the dang mess. There we go. All right, because I put it on the windows. Ready. Slides right off. Of course, it's going to, but it's still beating nice. Slides right off. To the panel. To the door. That's coming off good. Let's go. Let's try a different setting. Let's go flat. Working pretty good. Can't even go flat on the roof. goes let's look at it real quick before I end the video and I gotta redry it if 
before it gets too dark. All right, let me grab that stuff real quick. Okay, real quick, I also want to bring up this is not a sponsored video. We pay for our own product. Um, we test them out and then give you guys the best um, opinion we can on the product. And if we like it or don't like it. Um, or if we like it and some of the issues that are going on with the product. So if you bring that up, it would be nice to get some free product test out and to give an honest review. Okay, we're all done washing it for the four month update on the hypercharged chemical guys one coat on here. They say it's supposed to last up to 12 months. You can put up to four cuts, coats a year, a little bit more. So basically, if you put two coats on this every six months, you're pretty much gonna have some protection. We'll do another update um, beginning of October. So I'm gonna try, I like to put another coat on this before winter hits. So I know um, the paint's uh, covered on this. Um, that's what I would like to do. And then so, and I'll, I'll do some follow-ups the, through the winter on using the product, even though it will have two coats, you know, well, basically two coats in one year, every six months. And that's my goal. And then we can see how it looks, holds up through the winter. So right now, to me, it's holding up pretty good. Um, you guys can judge for yourself. Get, leave a comment below. Um, I've seen other videos where they're claiming it's only lasting a month. I, I don't know. Maybe my, it's my environment. I'm not really sure. But here, I'm going to show you guys the results. I'm not going to lie. Um, I know a lot of people... They bash chemical guys' products, and I'm not gonna. I only, you know, if it doesn't work, then it doesn't work, and that's what you bring up, in my opinion. I'm gonna be ranting a little bit right here. And to me, it's working right now. Four months. You guys seen the, hopefully, seen the video of me applying the product, all the steps we did to uh, apply the product. Um, that's why I like showing that in a video. My videos are long, it's because I'm showing the process before I put this product on so I can prove that I have taken the right steps before using the uh, products. And that's it. I mean, look at that. I'm impressed with it, how dirty it was that the Harbor Charge is working. I mean, right there, it's working, guys. You guys comment below. But, uh, yeah. That's, I'm dumbfounded how people can say it's not working. I really am. I say it's junk it's beating like crazy it looks great even the paint still looks like it still has the uh that glass look to it um like i said in two months i have an update next video i will on the on the jeep will be using their hypercharged soap with the foam cannon um try it out and it's supposed to help boost it which kind of i'm trying i'm trying to stay away from not doing using a booster but i want to make a video on using that product and it's going to help it and then it'd be less cleaning for me to do when I do the six months. Uh, another uh, coat on that in six months. Right there. And Sudsbox soap worked great cleaning it. There's no wax, nothing in it. It's nice cleaning wax. It's, uh, uh, I'm pretty sure it's pH neutral also. Great. I need to try this in a foam cannon also. Yeah, and Sudsbox soap works great. I'll have their link below. It's a small detailing company. They're making some products. I really like it. It's thick. Um, I use this in the winter. I like using this. I think for some more of the stuff. I like their bottles too. And I, I use the other products of theirs. Um, their rinseless wash works great. But uh, check it out. You guys tell me what you think of it. But, uh, yeah, that's it. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. I appreciate it. And um, hopefully this video helped you guys. You guys have a great day. Later. Well, right now, you guys have a great night. Later.